Hi guys, I'm Asaf, this is Itai, and today we're going to react to a song called Liar by Whiskey Dust, a Japanese band. This was a buy me a coffee request by a J Metal fan. Thank you, a J Metal fan. Thanks, J Metal fan. Looking forward to this one. Yep. We don't know this band. Uh, this is the first time we're re reacting to their song. Uh, yep. Here you go. Let's find out. I'm liking the sound, uh, for starters. I'm liking the look. I'm liking the vibe. It's got a real um, sort of like like live rock band type of vibe, you know, like something yeah. you would see in in sort of smaller venues, um, you know, mm -hmm. like a smoky kind of kind of bar kind of place. Yeah, I, I'm really loving it. Like I love her voice. It's different. Um, yeah. you know, it's, it's like, uh, like a, like a thick voice, you know, she's it's like a thick strong... voice. Yeah. It's textured yeah. like some, something similar to Adele's voice, the texture. It's got power behind it. You mm -hmm. can, you can just, you know, hear it. Yeah. Um, and yeah, yeah. Something very, very, very interesting, very sort of simple to the point, hard rock. Um, I have to say we, uh, could not find lyrics translation yeah. for this one. So all we know is this song is probably about a liar. Yeah, somebody who lies. <laughs> yeah, but we'll um, we'll just basically respond to to the music rather than uh, any kind of meaning. Um, and so far, I am loving this. Yeah, as am I. Mm. Grammar. <laughs>
I was gonna pause it, but then they shifted gears and I just couldn't. And what a gear shift it was. Something about her voice reminds me of bands like uh, Concrete Blonde. You know, where they have right. a, a lead singer with a sort of a deeper, fuller kind of voice. Um, really, really cool. And then they went into this blues transition. Yeah. Yeah. You know, it went from like a hard rock song to a blues song. And and it's it's almost like completely different songs, really. Yeah. You know, I I, I was a bit surprised and... and uh, um, I'm still unsure, I guess, about the transition. Like, I really enjoyed listening mm -hmm. to it, but I'm not sure how it fits um, with the rest of the song. But at the same time, we don't know the lyrics. We don't know what it means. So it could be something in the meaning there as well that, you know, justifies that kind of shift. Um, but either way, I love it. You know, they, 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 they sound really, really good in that style as well. Yeah. It, so... It very yeah. cool up till that point i enjoyed listening to it you kind of sort of project what it's going to be the, the way it's going to play out because you know the style and you've heard enough music but when they shifted gears it was so it's such a different ex experience it took me by surprise and uh it, it was just pure joy for me i really like uh yeah. I, I like blues it went from sort of high energy and then it just dropped it right down yeah uh, but something sort of very um, sort of introspective, I guess, about this this part. It's like, um, and again, her voice sounds. Fantastic. Her voice, yeah, I wanted to, the, her voice facilitates the the the, the blues element so well. Mm. She was she was born like, to like sing. So it, far, the the thought that I have going through my head is I, I, like I'm intrigued about this band. Like I want to know more about them and more about you know their music uh, because there's something definitely very very kind of different about it. Yep. something about her, like her voice when when she went into these yeah yeah yeahs kind of and she held them it sounds phenomenal almost like a, a like reminiscent of of you know sort of older metal bands um in the way she she sort of kept it going and it's just um yeah just just really really intriguing i i like their sound i like that it looks like they have something a bit different you know to say and also um before i forget um when she when she sang like in, in that sort of faster style the the sort of rock thing something about the way she sings um has a like a punk influence to it as well yeah could be yeah we don't know the lyrics but but by the structure of the song you can guess that it has a positive uh message because they climb back out of the the ocean they dove into for the blues section it was nice uh, the entire the entire structure was nice. You kind of saw it coming that they're gonna climb out, they're gonna finish mm -hmm. with hard rock, but it was nice. It wasn't the, the entire experience was very pleasant. Definitely didn't see the first shift shift coming. That was I didn't I like didn't. out of nowhere. Yeah, yeah I was uh, dumbfounded. But very very cool, very cool. Yeah, um, yeah thanks, uh, J Metal fan. That was thank you. Pretty awesome. Um, yeah, yeah. I kind of look forward to hearing more of their stuff. Yeah. And actually, I'm looking forward to listening to this song again as well. Yeah, this is one of those songs you know it's going to yeah. end up in your car and and you probably notice different things about it sort of you know as you go i, I also like the uh the name you know whiskey dust i can see it how it it goes from like you know sort of hard rock rock and roll and blues you know it's all sort of in that band name yeah 
Well, when I first uh, read the name, it sounded to me like uh, in my head, like a person who's trying to drown his sorrows in a bottle of whiskey, but there's no more whiskey. So he, just, he gets the dust. He or she gets the dust. Dust out of the bottle. Yeah, it, it almost sounds like a, a, a name for like a country band. Yeah. But yeah. it's not <laughs> the case. Okay. Yeah. Different, 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 not different, different, not different, no, no, no. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. No, very yeah. cool. Very yeah. cool. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. If you enjoyed this episode, guys, please be sure to like, subscribe, and click the little bell icon so you'll get notified on all our future videos. Share our stuff. It'll mean a lot to us and encourage us to make more videos for you guys. Hit us up in the comments. What did you think about Liar by Whiskey Dust? Did you like it? Let us know. Also, let us know what you would like to see us do next. We will do our very best to comply. If you have a request you'd like bumped up the line, please make it through Buy Me a Coffee. All contributions are, of course, very much appreciated. Thank you very much for sticking with us. Thank you very much for your time. And thanks again, a J Metal fan. Awesome request. Yeah, their songs usually start with this tractor beam that pulls you in. They start um, mellow, mellower and you're pulled in because it's nice and it's pleasant. And then they ignite something and it's like, uh, it's, like an, it's, like, it's like a bomb. It explodes in your head and glues you into the song itself. It's just... I, I think that even if they don't start mellower, sometimes they do start full force straight away and... By the time they, they reach the, the chorus, you realize you're, you're hooked. Yeah, we appreciate any requests that come from uh, uh, come through Buy Me A Coffee. Um, every little bit helps. And again, thank you guys. Thanks for everything. Without you, there would be no show. So we appreciate you more than you know. And uh, we look forward to seeing you again in the next one. See you soon, guys. <laughs> Bye. Bye, guys.